Hi and welcome back to my channel. I tried this three times and this time it will work. My name is Emma Sebasa and I'll be talking today about self-esteem and confidence. For many people it's a hard thing to gain. They think they can't do anything, they will never be something and they just give up. Yes, sure, if you want to live that way, fine, but you will get so much regret. I know many YouTubers have talked about this subject and they have a lot of things to teach and I want to give my personal opinion about this. So I am not, I have never been confident my whole life. Nobody's ever been. They may think they're confident but they're not. Tr trust me, trust me on that. My nose is so annoying. Forgive, forgive me, it's itching. Anyway, many people start as zero, at the bottom, and then gain themselves up. But that's because they tried and failed and tried again and failed and maybe the third time it went well. And if you don't like what you're doing, then do something else. If you don't like your job, then find something else. You don't like your education you're taking, then why are you taking it? Go on with your life, it's only this eternity you can live as you're today, you today. And if you don't live this as you want to, you're gonna have so much regret. And I know for a personal experience that I don't want to live with regrets. I've seen so many people before me who live with so much regret and it's it's annoying, it's freaking annoying. <sighs> yeah, but not only that, by doing stuff will gain you self-esteem and confidence, it's how you look and how you see yourself. I know I, I hated myself. I have hated this face. Sorry. <laughs> um, I hated my ears because I was bullied for them. And now, they're, I can show them a lot. I don't care. They're my ears. And if someone doesn't like them, then screw them. They're my ears. You don't have to deal with them if you don't look. And my nose, who is really big. Many people have bullied me for that. But it's my nose. So get the fuck off it. It's my face. It's my body. And... If you don't like your body, if you don't like you, if at the morning you feel like, oh, I look like crap, then walk out, close your eyes, count to three, and take some deep breaths, breaths, and then walk in again and see if you can find something you like. For me, it's my eyes, my hair, if it's washed. And I like it very much because there's a lot of volume. It makes it look like I have something here. I have a huge brain and it makes me feel like I'm smart. <laughs> and I like my underarms because I used to be an arm wrestler. And by that I gained so many, so gorgeous underarms. They're not the same, but I still love them. And by that, there's a lot of bad things that comes with doing things. Like, if I want to cut my hair off, people will think I'm a dude because I have a huge back. Very masculine back, my shoulders are very muscular. And, uh, yeah, I've been told that I look like a dude from behind when I had short hair. A lot. Sure, it was cool at the beginning because I felt like, why would I want to be a girly girl? It was not me. It's still not me. I'm still not a girly girl. But I can still pronounce myself as a female. Or a tomboy. It depends on my mood. But I'm still born as a woman. And I feel like a female. I don't want to change my gender. Those who you, you feel like it, do it. Please, be yourself. Be comfortable in your own skin. But otherwise, you are supposed to be no other person than you. If you pre 
pretend to be. Let's see, someone famous. I can only think of Tyler Oakley right now. If you want to, you can't be Tyler Oakley because Tyler Oakley is himself. You can get some inches, inches. What I'm saying, you can get some inspiration from him, but don't be him. Be yourself. I have learned from a lot of people, famous and not famous, and built me through that because you're not yourself at the beginning. You will always try and learn and get experiences, but you will build yourself when you get older. You're like a flower. You only bloom when you're ready. And I, I don't think I bloomed. Not yet. I'm still, I'm just 22. Maybe I'll bloom next year, who knows? Maybe I'll learn something new about myself because before I, I didn't like colorful things. I would never dye my hair blonde and I have done that two times. I would never wear this kind of makeup and I'm doing it. I would never wear blue and I started with it. I would never wear handbags like I do with like these I have now and I'm doing it. I feel so confident and I feel so me. More me than I used to. So hope you will gain something by this. If you like this movie movie film, give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more about me, subscribe. If you want to follow my other social medias, the description box will gain them all. Gain them all. Have them all. And hopefully, I'll see you soon. It'll be probably next Monday. Bye bye!